My name is Dr. Don Lalonde. I'm a professor of surgery at Dalhousie University in St. John, Canada. I'm going to discuss a paper by Dr. Sebastian and Chung on distal digital replants. It's a systematic review of level four papers, so it's level four evidence, but it's really the best evidence that we have on the topic because it has over 2,200 cases, which is huge. Distal digital replants is a very specific topic. And what they mean by distal is zone one from the tip of the finger to the base of the nail, and zone two from the base of the nail to the DIP joint. This is a really important topic because these replants are technically very hard to do. And many people who are of my generation in North America don't do this operation. We don't do it because we have this feeling that it's just too much work for not a great result. Dr. Chung's paper tells us that the results are actually pretty good. The success rate was 86% survival, which is very good considering how small the vessels are. The nerve results were also good with an average of 7 millimeter two-point discrimination, in spite of the fact that half of the nerves were not repaired, likely because they were quite distal. One of the important take-home messages is that you've got to have one good artery it's better if you can do a vein, but even if you can't, which is what happened in 40% of the cases, you can keep the blood flow going by taking off the nail and making a laceration in the nail bed or the tip of the finger and having a heparin plunge it to keep it going, which is what they did in 26% of the cases and only 3% of the time were leeches used. It's been our impression that the results are not that great because they might be stiff. Unfortunately, we don't get a lot of evidence about how stiff these digits are, and there's only one paper that Dr. Chung could find which actually compared amputation to replantation at this level. That paper did show that there were better DASH scores and less pain and good movement in the replant group than there were in the amputation group. This is an important paper because it may actually change practice in North America where distal digital replants are not done nearly as common as they are in the Orient. 70% of these cases came from the Orient. Paper well done. Thank you.